Good morning, my brother. Welcome to your daily grip on God's Word. It's great to be back with you, but I do want to pause and thank Mr. Countryman for stepping in the last week. Man, such wisdom and just the life experiences that he has and the boldness that he now speaks uh, with his faith, especially into our hearts, our minds, and really challenges to be all that God has called us to be. So thank you, Jack. Grateful for pouring into us. Today, we're going to start out with Romans chapter 9. And I had three verses that rose up, verses 30 through 32. Here's my G for getting a grip on God's word. What then shall we say that the Gentiles who did not pursue righteousness have obtained it, a righteousness that is by faith, but Israel, who pursued a law of righteousness, has not attained it? Why not? Because they pursued it not by faith, but as if it were by works. They stumble over the stumbling stone. All right, there's my verses. Here is my reveal. The stumbling stone was Jesus. How many times have I stumbled to align to the ways of Jesus, which means being humble and being obedient? And I've given in to the ways of the world all about me and doing what I want to do. How many times have I stumbled over that? Too many. My implementation is I need to keep showing up for my daily tea time with the Lord and staying grounded in his word. My prayer back to God is this. Lord, my heart's desire is to walk with you by faith as you lead and guide my every step. You keep, please keep me aligned to your great commission. All right, guys, that's gripping chapter nine of Romans. Love to hear what verse rose up for you. And again, if you are longing to connect from this maybe individual connection to a community of other guys, feel free to respond to the email. Let me know, I'll get you plugged into our Wednesday night virtual group that meets 8 p.m. Central Time, and you also have now an earlier group at 7 p.m., and you are more than welcome to join us in that community as we get a grip on God's Word. Okay? Let me close this out. Heavenly Father, Lord, thank you, God, that as we continue to go now down this road of Romans, um, Lord, just continue to let your living Word rise up to each and every one of us as we get a grip on it. Lord, embed it onto our hearts, that we are then walking out your Word in this life here on earth. We love you, Jesus. We pray this in your powerful name. Amen. All right, God bless you guys. Have an awesome day.